Hello friends, a very good morning to you. So let's start the week with some nice different cooking today. So let's start it with a healthy salad. But it's a, again it's like a complete meal. So what all we need is we are making a spinach salad with uh, feta cheese. That's a grilled feta cheese and with some roasted um, beetroot noodles. I will just show you what is beetroot noodles as well. So let's start first. So this is spinach. You have cherry tomatoes. You have some basil, chili flakes, lemon zest, orange zest. Then you have maple syrup. You have salt, thyme. Then you have is black pepper. This is freshly grounded black pepper. Lemon juice. Then you have is chopped garlic, grated ginger maple syrup, feta cheese, olive oil, chili flake, this is a paprika, then you have is a corn flour, bread crumbs, and now this is what I have done is beetroot noodles. So you can see I have made these with this wire cutter sparrow, and this is really nice. I don't know, you must be having something different or something similar. I have used this and see how nicely they are. So it's very nice. And now let's start it. So now, we are first of all we are cooking a spinach. So you need to add it a one teaspoon of one tablespoon of olive oil. Just saute some garlic and some ginger. We are starting with the procedure of feta. So first. We need to add as a bit of olive oil and saute the orange zest. So let it saute for a minute. Let that aroma set in. So you can see the orange zest, the aroma is really coming so well. It's beautiful. And uh, let's keep this aside. So now, this is the feta cheese. We need to cut as a bit of slices. So cut the slices nicely and we'll make a square. You have to handle this very softly. And now we'll make a so now in a bowl we'll take a corn flour. We'll add some water to it. Make a nice smooth paste and in another bowl or a flat plate you can just add is the breadcrumbs. Now dip this very gently, dip this feta cheese in the corn flour dip. Apply nice coating of the breadcrumb and grill it on a griller. So you can see how nicely they have been coated and now let's start grilling them. So this is the griller ready. I'll just apply a bit of olive oil, put it on a high flame and place your feta cheese. It's not going to get melt, don't worry and put it here. So this is done from the down, now you need to turn it around very delicately and see this is done. So you can see how nicely the feta cheese has been grilled. Now we'll just remove this in a flat plate and then let's we'll make the sauce which is a lemon zest which is of uh, orange zest then you have this black pepper maple syrup so we'll just make the sauce out of it and let's see. So now we are making the sauce so just put a little bit of olive oil and add as a very little garlic to it just for the flavor you don't have to add much in this and very little of ginger just saute it a bit now you remember we had crushed this black pepper please saute this because the fragrance of this is really nice and once you saute it it becomes more fragrant full so please do this saute it a bit and now we are adding is maple syrup to it. 
and we'll add as a pinch of salt and we'll add as thyme to it so that's thyme now let it cook for a minute so you see the maple syrup sauce is ready and you remember we roasted this orange zest and now we'll put the orange zest in it so your yeah, this sauce which you're supposed to pour is ready now we are making this uh, dressing for the beetroot so take olive oil now you need to add as a bit of garlic and this we are adding a bit of lemon zest then add few chili flakes ginger and approximately 2 spoons of uh, lemon juice and we'll put a pinch of salt now mix it well you don't really need to add any flavor to it but in case you're very keen you can add as oregano or some fresh basil but uh, I think it tastes like this only very nice so this is our beetroot noodles you can see how nicely they look like noodles if you can see see they exactly look like noodles so we'll just pour them place it nicely and apply the dressing which you made in case you want you can add as roasted sesame seed to it later on we'll do that later on but uh, right now this is done and now bake it for 10 to 15 minutes in the oven at 180 degrees celsius now we are preparing the dressing for cherry tomatoes so here is a bit of olive oil we'll add as a pinch of black pepper then definitely small amount of salt and we'll add as just one spoon of lemon juice mix it well and we'll add as a bit of basil tone leaves so here it is and we'll add as these cherry tomatoes now mix it well and we'll bake it for just five to ten minutes that's it we don't want to over bake this because we're all set you can see this is the grilled feta cheese and you have as noodles cherry tomatoes you have as sesame seeds to garnish then this is the spinach which we did that's the sauce some more black pepper to garnish and this is thyme and basil to garnish again so let's assemble it so this is the ring and I'm just placing the spinach remove the spinach now I'll place a feta cheese on it put the sauce put some black pepper and your dish is ready